Today, let's talk about where is my stimulus payment. Recently, there are few clients come to me and ask th- this question. So most of the people already received this stimulus tax payment, and as you know, there were three tax payment. The first one is twelve hundred dollars. And it should be all issued by December twenty twenty, and the second one is six hundred dollars, and they started to issue and send out in December twenty twenty, and the third one is fourteen hundred dollars, and it was started to send to taxpayer in March twenty twenty one. So as of now, most of the people should receive this payments already. But there are some people they did not get the payment. So what are they gonna do? First, you need to find out if you actually qualify for this assistance payments. So, for example, right here, there's a very good summary. Let's say if in 2020 you file as a single filer and your income is less than seventy five. Thousand a year, then you should qualify for all three tax payment. If you have not get that, then you should do something about that. And if you are married filing jointly, your total income is less than hundred and twelve thousand dollars, then you should also qualify. Then so forth. You can take a look of this、uh, requirement. So the next thing is to make sure that you really did not receive the payment and. Some of the taxpayer they receive a direct deposit from the IRS during the year, and they spend the money already, and they did not even realize that they have that system payment already sent it to their account. So you need to go back to your bank account and make sure that you already or not have not received the tax payment from the IRS, because the IRS. To the extent they have your financial record and you use that bank account to make tax payment in the past, so the payment will be directly deposited into your account. And the second way to find out is see if you already receive a check and deposit it.、Uh, you probably will remember, could remember if you get a payment in that way, or you don't remember, then you can call the IRS or you sign up an online with the IRS and. In that case, you can see all the information the IRS have for you. So, how to sign up the IRS account is really easy. Just go to www.irs.gov and open an account, sign up with them. You can see the tax return you file with them, and the tax payment,、uh, the economic impact payment. We also call the stimulus payment on the account if they already paid you. And also,、uh, if you have advanced child tax credit payment received, and so forth. What if you have not received first and second payment? What are you gonna do? It's really simple. So first, you see if you are eligible, or in the next one, you're going to find out if you actually have not received the payment. Third, you are going to file the 2020 form 1040. So if you have never filed your tax return, then you should because if you qualify,、uh, you have not filed a tax return, the IRS would not have your record to make that payment. So then you need to file the tax return, or if you already filed a tax return, did not tell the service that you actually qualify, then you need to amend the tax return. So here is a tax return on page two, line thirty. This is where you tell the service that you actually qualify for the、uh, for the payment. If you did not receive first and second payment, then you should file a twenty twenty tax return to claim that. If you have not received the third payment, that is、uh, the tax return which is going to be due in April on April fifteen twenty twenty one. So this is the time that you file the tax return and ask for that fourteen. Hundred dollar payment. So in summary, there are three payment. The first one is twelve hundred dollars. The second one is six hundred dollars. First and second payment is for twenty twenty. So if you have not received it and you confirm that you qualify and you have not filed a tax return for twenty twenty, then you should file the tax return in twenty twenty and claim that refund. If you already filed the twenty twenty tax return. 
without claiming for the credit, then you should go back and amend the tax return. The third payment is fourteen hundred dollars. If by now you have not received the payment, then you should file your twenty twenty one tax return and claim a refund on this fourteen hundred dollars. So here is a quick summary. So. How do you prepare an individual tax return? There are a lot of items we need to pay attention to. So next one, we're going to talk about the child tax credit and make sure you consult with your own tax advisor or your tax preparer. So everybody's situation is different, so so they can give you more specific advice. Thank you.